Plans are underway to reconstruct AR-3, but our intelligence sources tell us the effort has barely begun. If we can strike fast, we can destroy AR-3 before the base is operational. That would cripple what's left of the Gorian effort. But I make this mission sound easier than it is. We've learned that there is a very dangerous first step that must be accomplished before we can attack. A very clever and hazardous minefield surrounds the base. If we're going to strike the reactors and blow the base up, we have to destroy the minefield first. Our mission, then, is to destroy this minefield and neutralize any Gorian patrols in the region. Exclamation, everybody, and welcome back to Star Crusader. We are giving the Gorians a black eye in, in every every position that we possibly can. And they keep trying to rebuild their forward bases of operations, and we keep taking them out. And now it is time to prepare for the final strike on AR-3, the newly rebuilt or in progress being built uh, space station. Uh, we'll take Krugon with us. Why not? Uh, combat resources. I think, uh, giving us both liberators is probably an okay thing. Uh, we'll see. I, I have a feeling he'll make... Oh, you know what? Krugon is... No, let's take Hella. <laughs> because, um, yeah. Krugon, Krugon is, is, is a wimp. <laughs> he leaves, he leaves too quickly. Uh, in the meantime, we'll do some combat missions. We'll do a little bit, uh, a little bit dangerous here. We'll put Krugon on it because he's he's a pain in the neck. Uh, Tuta and Stellarex and Lord Claw, Crawl or whatever his name is. Um, and Overlord Claw. Why not? Oh, I can't. Uh, let's. Is that did I assign? No. Let's take one of these other ones off of here. Let's take. Uh, yeah. Let's take him off of there and let's put. Uh, Overlord Cool on there. And Dirtide Zamus. I feel like he's an unkillable person. But anyway, we'll do that. And then everybody else is on defense, as always, including LaForge. <laughs> and then we will it's it's a shame you can't have you can't launch multiple offensive missions, but uh, it's just not I, I the game was not really you know, on the Goreen side of the fence, you don't really have that many pilots to launch multiple missions, so I guess they just decided, you know, screw it. One one of each is enough. So there we go. Let's see what we can do here. Active minefield detected. Reduced. Do you think you can actually win Alexandria? Prana 7 is nearly completed, and when it is, the Ascalon Rift is ours. Oh, Lanthor, you're so you're so predictable. Uh, all right, so we got Lanthor here. What else do we have? Uh, I imagine some kind of minefield control. Well, there's a mine right there on our tail. Um, I assume there's some kind of minefield control thing here because there's only two <laughs> two scorpions here, and one of them is Lanthor, and he's gonna he's just gonna bug out as soon as we damage him enough. So I'm guessing we need to just find the minefield control. Uh, control panel somewhere. All right, so we'll just for the moment we'll just go after Lanthor until we find it. I have a feeling it's going to take a few minutes for it to to rear up. Actually, is that mine that was there that was showing up? Is that was just that? Okay, it wasn't active. All right, I thought is it is it an active mine or is it because I haven't gotten any any uh notification about it. So I wonder if that's actually something I should take out on my own here. Sensors detect. Oh, here it mine. comes now. Um, yeah, okay. Where is this mine at? There it is. Can't even see the damn thing. Incoming mine. You barely even see it. All right, well that's not that's not doing me any good. Oop, oop, that's wrong one. <laughs> uh, yeah, once. All right, so what else we got here? 
Tactical map. Is that, has anything else shown up other than just a few mines? Ooh, what is this? Aha, the controller mine. That is what I was looking for. All right. Let's go for that one. Oh, oh, it just disappeared again, didn't it? Tactical map. Uh, crap. All right, so it's, it was definitely back in this area. I don't know how to get, to get it to show up again. Um, damn. All right. Well, we'll have to, we'll have to wait a little bit and see what we can do here. Okay. Sensors detect incoming mine. Let's see if we can get Lanthor to just bug out here. That would be that would be perfect. Uh, yeah, not quite, not quite yet, huh? Haven't had enough yet, Lanthor. Damn mines. He's right on her tail too. I can't can't get at him. Let's see if we can get his attention. No, not now. I almost had him. Jumping ship gold leader. Damn it. Uh there we go. Got him to disengage. Excellent. All right, take out this other, this other scorpion, if we can. Slow down a bit. All right, let's see if that controller mine has shown up again. No, it hasn't. I feel like I'm going in the wrong direction to have it show up. That's the problem. Bunch of mines. Okay. Got some more got some more torpedoes where that came from, guy. Yeah, that's right, just line up for me. Come on, come on. Yep. Nope, nope, still <laughs> still trying. He's still kicking. Right, what's he what's he down to anyway? Should be able to see that. Oh, he's at 103% damage? Jeez. Alright, so not that. Oh, he's disengaging. Alright. So now I still have to find this controller mine somewhere around here. Uh, let's see if we can see if we can get it to pop up a little bit. Or maybe I don't have to. I, I'm not sure. I don't actually this particular mission I don't even remember. <laughs> I'll be perfectly well you know what? Oh well, there it is. No that's just a mine. Um, no I actually <laughs> I don't remember this mission because I've never actually played it before. I, ne I never played the Alliance um, pathway here. So I don't know what the winning conditions are for this. Other than try to find the controller mine. That's all I can think of, right? Neutralize patrols, clear minefield. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Is that the mine that I'm looking for right there, maybe? Alright, well, let's go this way and see if this is leading me in the right direction. It's a good thing these mines are not not really that destructive. Um, tactical map. Yes, that is the controller mine. Alright, good. There we go. Minefield deactivated. And I would think that that would be a mission complete, but it doesn't look like it is. So I don't know. Is there another? Do I have to just destroy the remaining mines that are around here? 
Now I think uh, I think it's I think the mission is complete. Uh, even though I didn't destroy those other things. Oh, what's this over here? Wait a minute. That doesn't look right. What is that? Is that just a mine? Yeah, it's just a mine. Mission there we Please go. Return to base. Now it's mission complete. <laughs> was that the was that the last remaining mine that was just kind of floating around? No, there's a couple more. I guess. I don't know. I guess it just took a, an extra little thing there to get a mission complete. All right, so there we go. I think we are we are done here. Let's go back to base and see what we can what we can get. Unfortunately, I think I've lost. I think she ejected. I think Hella ejected. So we might have might have lost another liberator, which are in short supply as it is. Um, the combat mission was a success. There were no casualties. We have secured three sectors of Gorian space. Excellent. Very good. 100% uh, completed. And we got another pilot. Uh, we'll just call her Jane, Janeway. Uh, I guess we already had a Janeway, huh? Um, Cisco? Maybe? <laughs> just random names here. Uh, what's our tactical map room look like? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We're, we're pushing them back. We are most definitely pushing them back. And there's AR3 right there. All the other bases are destroyed, and then there's Piranha 7. Hopefully we don't have to take on Piranha 7, because <laughs> that, is, that is going to be a pain. Very much a pain. Let's save our progress. Mission, uh, I think this is 32B. All right, let's see what's up, what's up next. We have no time to waste. We have to act now if we're going to destroy AR-3. The window of opportunity is closing. More Goring patrols are on their way to defend the base. There are already heavy patrols surrounding it. There's no time to argue or debate. Let's get to our ships now. If we can destroy AR-3, we'll be a step closer to finishing off the Gorines. All right, this is this is the mission, and this is what we have to do. Uh, so select wingman. All right, we'll get uh, Krugan. Oh, not him. Hella. Um, Tuta. Lord Crawl, Stellarex, um, Overlord Cool, Dirk Tide Zamus. All right, and then I'm just gonna put. Well, let's see here. I am taking a Liberator. Everyone else gets uh, gets Scorpions. Well, there's only three Scorpions, so I guess they're not gonna all take that. Uh, and some, I guess some Warlords. Yeah, yeah I guess that'll do. And then uh, we'll say assemble squadron. I'm in the Liberator. Excellent. That's what I want it. And secondary missions. I'm just going to set everybody to defense because I don't feel like there's any need to send out the red shirts on an offensive mission when we're already giving the Gorines a pretty, uh, pretty black eye here. So there we go. Excellent. And let's head on out. Pray for a quick death, traitor. If you're captured, Shiloh plans to execute you. Well, whoop de do for Shiloh. All right, I have I have my eyes on the prize here. So let us let us do that because I have a feeling that this is going to be. There's probably a ton of stuff here, and. Yeah, there's there's a ton of stuff here. Although it's all scorpions, that's interesting. None of the none of the heavy weaponry, huh? Uh, but yeah, I I really don't need to don't need to hang around here. Let's just let's just head for AR three and and make this a a quick quick and painless thing, hopefully. So we'll get a we'll get some speed on. And yes, we have got some incoming fire. <laughs> Krugan. Damn it, Krugan. We haven't even been here that long, for crying out loud. Looks like they've already got AR-3 shields down. That's awesome. Alright. So let's just, uh, see what we can do here. If I can, if I can get there, it's before, before my guys take it down. <laughs> get the shields down again. Alright. Well, <laughs> I guess I'm not going to get the pleasure of taking AR3 down. Uh, all right. Well, that that was that was a thing. It certainly was a thing. 
right, so we'll just take out some of these scorpions, I guess. All right. <laughs> at least my, at least my torpedoes can do can make short work of things. Uh, I just wish I had uh, had unlimited, unlimited torpedoes. That would be rather awesome. Um, what else is going on here on the tactical map? Is it, is it just a ton of people here? What's who's that? That's Dirt Tide Zamus. Should probably pick him up. Uh, we got uh, Scorpion here. That's damaged. Couple scorpions over there. We, uh, Stas Klemp is still here, um, but it looks like he's looks like they are possibly going after him. I no, they're all <laughs> they are all focused on this one scorpion. That's kind of what I hate about the AI in this game. It's like, hey, yeah, we got twenty ships. We're all going to focus on one freaking guy instead of spreading out a bit and focusing on all the other things that are going on. Oh, good. Stellarex is picking him up. Excellent. All right. Hey, come on. Come on. Get, uh, come, come over here and get your death, Scorpion. Damn. Damn dirty Goreens. <laughs> oh, that was my last torpedo. <laughs> Let's get uh, our disruptors on here and see if we can do even more damage. Okay, come on. End up just using this because it is a little bit more powerful than trying to trying to get the. Well, or my my friends can actually jump in and do something for a change. That's very good. Uh, where's this guy at? There he is. Okay, I think that he's being he's being targeted by several people. Let's see if he decides to turn around and come after me. Mm, that don't look like it. All right, are they gonna just take him out? Cause that would be awesome. Wow. <laughs> It's it's interesting to watch it from the other from the other side here while all the sparks start flying. All right, you you take him out. Uh, so tactical map. Is there anyone else here? Anyone else that wants something? I think uh, did Stas Kemp uh, already bug out? Because I don't see him anywhere. I do see an escape pod? I, did Stellarex not? Oh, Stellarex is over there. All right, good. Um. Yeah, it looks like uh, looks like Staz Kemp decided to to take his leave of us, which is fine by me. Or not. Yeah, I hate how my my buddies do that all the time. Uh, is that is that it? Did we. I mean, I know there's one more scorpion here, but you know, there's another one over there too. But I don't see any reason to stick around. Are these? What are my buddies doing? He's he's leaving, I think. That guy's coming after me. Uh, Overlord Cool is going after him. Okay, that's fine. You can have him. And then this guy is way out there, so he's not going to catch up. All right. Well, given all that, I think I I think we can end the the pain and suffering here and just uh, and just uh, get, get on, move along home. So that is what I'm going to do. Let my let my minions <laughs> take care, clean up, uh, mop up the rest of the enemies. Roman Alexandria reviews the mission results. Awesome. That was only like what the twentieth time we've we've destroyed that station. <laughs> uh, all right. Oh, I only got I only got a good pilot rating for that one. Oh well. Uh, please report to the tactical map room. 
A Gorian assault force initiated an attack during your mission. They were turned back. No casualties were reported. Excellent. It's because I had everybody, everybody and their grandmother on a defensive mission. <laughs> um, let's see. I think that will do it for this episode of Star Crusader. Yes, that's the word I wanted to use. Thanks for watching, everybody. I will see you next time. Thank you.